Hello! Welcome to a Suntup unboxing, an unenveloping that says do not bend. This, my friends, is one that I'm really excited about and just never in a million years thought I'd get. This is the uh, Schindler's Arc broadside. Very excited about that. Um, if you, you know, you've watched the channel, you know that I like me some little art prints or broadsides. Uh, I mean, I love a good book as well, but I especially love little pieces of art. I'm a knick-knack guy that way. Whoa, my camera just did something weird. Wow. Uh, so this was limited to 77 copies. 20 of 6 went with the lettered editions. I imagine some were left over for... Wow. Some were left over to be kind of... Uh, a, oh my God, backup copies. In case something got damaged, something happens. Uh, sold out immediately. Didn't get a chance to buy it. Uh, and I mentioned a few videos back, I did the unboxing for... Uh, I Know Why the Cage Bird Sings, Maya Angelou. Got a signed copy of that through Easton Press. And I mentioned in that video that I had another Easton Press title coming along that I was very excited about. That Easton Press title was, or would have been, uh, The Martian Chronicles, signed by Ray Bradbury. But, unfortunately, I ordered a copy, and then uh, the next week I got a letter in the mail saying, hey, we oversold, and you're not getting a copy of the, you know, we don't have that in stock, which was very unfortunate. And I was like, I was a little bummed. Later that same day, I was at the right time, the right place on the Fans of Suntup page when somebody posted that this broadside was back in stock. Wouldn't you know, it was meant to be. I managed to snag a copy. It was incredible. So it's like, you know, it offsets the disappointment in not being able to get the sign Bradbury with getting this. Of course, has a wood engraving by uh, Howard Phipps. It's straight from the wood block, print pressed right on there. Absolutely stunning. It has it in Hebrew, uh, in the quote in English, anybody who destroys a single life, uh, it is counted as if he destroyed an entire world. And for anybody who preserves a single life, it is counted as if he preserved an entire world. Uh, Schindler's Ark, of course, uh, was published earlier this year, I think it was what, late last year? Was it earlier this year that it was announced, or was it late last year? I don't know. Time is irrelevant. Uh, I have the artist edition. Uh, this is, so this paper that's printed on uh, was, speci was specially created uh, from, how does it say it on here? Paper from Izar Newman uh, out in Israel. So this was imported. This paper was imported from Israel. It was uh, illustrated. Howard Phipps. Uh, it even has a special watermark. It's a sign. It's the Star of David. Can't really see it very well there. Maybe you can. Maybe you can't. Wow. Uh, hand printed by Sandy Tilcock. Absolutely stunning. This, I, I gotta frame it. I gotta do a beautiful matte job because it's kind of got the deckled edge, you know, which is very much part of the design. It is stunning. It's larger than I thought. I mean, I know it said it was 8 by 12 online, but you kind of take it for granted, and then you get it, and you're, you see it, and you're like, wow, this, uh, there's my dog. <laughs> is that coming out on the video? Probably. Knowing, you know, going into it that it was 8 by 12, um, but then actually seeing it in your hands, and you're like, wow, it's bigger than... I anticipated, which is very much something that she didn't say, but I'll say it anyways. Wow. So thank you to Paul Suntup for such a beautiful broadside. Beautiful books as well. Like I said, the books are superb. I do not, I personally do not have the numbered edition of Schindler's Ark, nor do I have the advanced reader car copy, which would have been Schindler's Ark, Ark, which is disappointing and a completely missed opportunity. I do have the artist edition, which is stunning. It is beautiful. Um, and now I am very, very thrilled to add this broadside to my collection. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching. This was limited to 77 copies. This is 67. It is numbered. Thank you very much for watching. I have a ton of other Suntup unboxings on my channel and will continue to have them on my channel in case you, you think, hey, what would Jeff 
Terry's Jeff Ward videos be like without a personality? Well, my friends, like and subscribe and you'll find out. <laughs> uh, I have fun. I have fun. But uh, anyways, yeah, lots of unboxing videos, Suntup and otherwise. Um, I mean, you should definitely check out the Jeff Word, and it's terrific as well. Uh, both great box videos from both of them as well. Um, but I do it as well, just for the fun of it. Just because, hey, you know, I'm buying the books anyways, so might as well share them with you. You know, put your VR goggles on, get first person like you do here. You know, live your life. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you around next time.